Suleiman. A uh, swamp sucker was invented back in 1998. Uh, basically, uh, most of the top Finnish cross country skiers used to train in the summer in the swamp area because it's very good exercise for the, uh, for the fitness. And here in Hyrynsalmi, a skier came up with the crazy idea of combining football and skiing. And you know, the first uh, competition was held in 1998 uh, uh, near Hyrynsalmi with 13 teams. Uh, the biggest difference, difference is obviously the playing uh, field we play in the swamp. Uh, the playing time obviously is a lot shorter, it's 2 times 10 minutes. But basically it is the same rules as in football uh, with just smaller teams. Uh, this year we are very happy to have almost 140 teams. Uh, back in the top years the number was almost 250, but the Covid came in and you know cut down the number. But the event is rising now and we are expecting to have almost 200 next year. Well, we just play kind of soccer in the swamp. Uh, Obviously we get stuck in the swamp and we lose our shoes in the swamp and so on but we just try to get the ball to the goal. That's the main purpose. One of the biggest challenges is when you have you're playing defense and you're really behind the player that you should play against and you're just stuck and you you just can't move. Yeah. It's here and here, I would say. Yeah, and also you have to be quite fit. Uh, yeah. because it's it's really hard and and sometimes you can't you can't run you have to crawl it's the first first time um, we won uh, last year uh, in September around uh, August um, the German Cup of uh, swamp soccer um, it's not that, that huge like here but uh, we won that and uh, that's why we got invited for the uh, professional league here um, yeah, the fields are really different to soccer. Um, every field, like here, is uh, different. Some like really dry. Some are really the swamp, and you sink in uh, like the whole body, and you need to crawl. 